there is the magical thing, I think, about all soaps is the dramatic irony you get as a viewer. Because we can see what you can see, mm. but Rona just can't see it. She can't. And you just want to shake her. I know. And I think it's uh, for Vanessa, she is the audience. She's the viewers. And there's nobody else in that village that's, that's seeing what she can see. Even, even Paddy's just saying, look, just leave it. She's getting married. Uh, she, if she's happy, she loves him. And at one point, then Vanessa was like, OK, yeah, you know, she is a best friend. So that's when she went up to make amends. But then caught him watching the um, sex tape that he said that had be, that he'd deleted, yeah. and he'd not. Again, more lies. So, and do you find people coming up to you saying that and saying, "Why can't everyone else see it?" It's yes, so frustrating. Absolutely. Uh, it was only the other day, and I was getting uh, my granddad a birthday card, <laughs> and the lady who was serving me, she just went. I hope you get that pierce. Oh, I do. I hope, I hope she believes you soon. So, <laughs> But the thing is, on social media, a lot of people have been saying, they've been getting so frustrated because they've been saying, yeah. why isn't Vanessa just filming him with her phone? Or, But oh. then it, it'd be over too quickly, wouldn't it? It can't be as simple <laughs> as that. That could be something down the line. That could be eventually the way you save her. Possibly. Inspired be, yeah. by the viewers and social media. Exactly. You yeah. could come out as, as, as the knight in shining arm. But it's brilliantly portrayed. I mean, that's what's so clever about the writing, and, and it's been a great year for Emmerdale anyway. Yeah. But just to the, the nuanced and the snakiness of Pierce as well and how manipulative he is. Oh, and it's been uh, quite a slow burner as mm. well because obviously he came into it on the back of um, Paddy having the affair with his uh, wife Tess, who then died, and, and it all then... Uh, he got very quickly his feet under the table with Rona. And there were little snippets of him being sort of, you know, a bit controlling and manipulative, but <coughs> Vanessa's really seen that now and he's threatened her, he's threatened her baby, mm. and it's going to get quite dark. It's... Um, there's, a, there's a long way to go yet. And, of course, we've got Ashley Thomas's funeral as well this week, which has meant you've had to say goodbye to a friend who's been on the show for, what, 20, 23 years, Absolutely, something like that? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, uh, for me, Vanessa didn't have uh, that many scenes with him apart from, like, in the yeah. wall pack, but it'll certainly be missed, and it'll be missed, you know, around the building. Wonderful, wonderful actor, wonderful man, and it's just heartbreaking this It's going to be an emotional day <laughs> tomorrow, of course. It's Definitely. been quite a year for your character, though, because you found out your irritating former housemate, Tracy, was your half-sister, <laughs> yeah. uh, discovered that Kieran was really the father of your baby, only yeah. see him flee the country after a drunken hit and run. Mm. Uh, now your best friend is being menaced by this psychotic control freak in the guise of her fiance. Yeah, and my dad's come out of prison. And he, and he was Robin just... Hood. <laughs> Who knew? <laughs> uh, do you ever open the script and go, what now? What's oh, I love it. Now? Yeah, I don't really go up for meetings much because uh, we've got a wonder our wonderful new producer Ian McLeod um, and assistant producer Kate Brooks, who have sort of got the baton from Kate Oates, who's yes. now at Coronation Street, and they've run with it, and it's just been fantastic uh, the storylines. But I, I do, I don't go up that often, but I like to just get the scripts and then oh, what's coming next. It's great. It's yeah. just like reading a really exciting book that's Gripping never novel. ending. Yeah. Well, look, we're gripped by it as well, Michelle. It's lovely to see. You. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. For uh, me. And 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 we're looking forward to seeing how this unveils and and. And maybe start filming him for heaven's sake. Listen yeah. to the people on social media. I'll try. Tell the producer. <laughs> <laughs> Love you too. Thanks for Thank you.